Hi, it's Mixie again. So today I want to show you how to make a quick and easy hair mask, okay? So when you guys receive uh, the, the gel for this, it's already going to be pre-made. So really all you have to do is just measure it out and put it in on your hair. Um, you will receive a bigger uh, size of the CMOS gel and the aloe vera gel mixture, okay? So what is CMOS gel? CMOS gel is actually an algae uh, that grows, uh, well, some of them grow like in the Caribbean, uh, some, some other CMOS gel, or I apologize, other CMOSs, um, they grow like off the coast of Ireland. Um, so you have the cold water sea moss and then you have the warm water sea moss. And so basically it's packed with minerals, making it amazing for moisture, not only for our skin, but for our hair. So this would be great for our curly headed babes out there. Or even if you have straight hair, that's fine. Um, now that, you know, the cold weather is upon us, um, I personally deal with dandruff. And so this is a really good hair mask that not only gives my uh, scalp the moisture that it needs, it also uh, helps replenish and uh, detail my, my curls a lot more. So I do have curly hair, <laughs> believe it or not. So this is a really good um, hair mask to, to use at home. You can do this once a week. Uh, depending on you know the condition of your scalp depending on the condition of your hair you can do it even twice um, one thing I do want to stress is never apply or I apologize never warm up aloe vera or sea moss uh, in in a microwave you're going to denature the the quality and the integrity of the sea moss you're going to strip it of those minerals that our hair actually needs um, so it kind of defeats the purpose. And so if you, if you're going to warm this up, just take, you know, the amount that you need, warm it up in a pot, low, low heat, maybe 30 to 60 seconds and you're good to go. And so it's, it's going to kind of look like a, like an applesauce consistency. That's perfect. That's what you want to aim for. And so depending on how much hair you have, um, then that's going to determine the amount um, that you're going to need. But basically, I would say just start off with about two to three tablespoons to add a little bit of water to it, you know, play with the consistency, and then go ahead and apply it on your scalp, uh, work it through the, the hair all the way to the end, leave it on for about 40, 45 minutes. You can actually wrap your hair up in a plastic Meyer bag if you want to. Um, the heat is gonna actually help lock in that moisture. Uh, once you're done, rinse it off in cool water and you're good to go. So that's, um, that's a nice and quick and easy hair mask um, with literally things that you can have access to in your kitchens. All right, so let me show you how to make this sea moss and aloe vera gel, uh, hair gel, okay? Um, so for starters, we are going to um, heat up our pot. This is a small pot like that, really low temp, okay? Um, we're gonna take about two to three tablespoons. Like I said, it really depends, uh, you know, the amount of hair that you have. So. You can, you can just really work with it, okay? If you wanna make it a little bit thinner, um, you can add some water. I just had, that's about like two tablespoons of water right there, okay? And then you just wanna start stirring it. Like I said before, you don't ever want to warm this up in a microwave. You will denature it and it, it will just defeat the purpose um, of, of its benefits. So like I stated, the CMOS gel is really good to help define your curls, also for moisture. Um, it helps inflamed uh, scalp, so you know, if you have psoriasis, maybe even some eczema, it's really good for uh, dry scalp as well. And then aloe vera is just amazing anyway for your skin, and yes, our scalp is our skin, so we want to take care of that now that the cold weather is here. Aloe vera definitely helps put in moisture. It's all about moisture. Really, that's that's really the point of this hair mask, okay? So this kind of looks like, well, let's turn this off. This consistency 
almost looks like applesauce really and that's what you that's that's what you want um you don't want to warm this up for more than 60 seconds okay um and then you just put it like in a little glass um or you know ceramic jar or little dish whatever you have available okay and then um what you do is it should be yeah see it's it's warm it should never be hot you want to apply this from your root down through your scalp so you want to kind of work it through the the shaft of the hair all the way down to to the root okay um if you need more definitely go ahead and grab maybe you know two two tables tablespoons more add a little bit of water to your preferred consistency leave it on your hair and scalp for about 45 minutes go on about your business go on facebook go clean whatever you want to do and then uh jump in the shower the 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 sink whatever whatever is easiest for you rinse that out in um lukewarm water so not too too warm not too too cold and then you can style it as you want you can just leave it nice and wet and just go ahead about your business you can blow dry it, however however you want to style your hair um whatever whatever your preference is but yeah that's what i do uh once a week especially now that the cold weather is coming upon us um like i said my scalp suffers unfortunately so this is a really good way to keep the dandruff down and to define my curls and keep that moisture that my hair just needs and loves all right um so yeah i hope you guys enjoy it thank you